allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Good morning Panthers. Panthers. Join us for our first French meeting after school on September 25th in room 251. We'll be doing French trivia and eating snacks. The senior class will be selling Krispy Kreme donuts for $10 a box. Pre-order your boxes by October 2nd. Boxes will be delivered on October 8th. Senior class officers Alyssa, Serena, Tiona, or Biandra for any questions. Student activities uh, slash club photos will be taken by Life Touch this year. Please make every effort to show up in the lobby on November 12th and November 19th for your club photos. These are the only dates that photos will be taken this year. Please let Ms. Manning or Ms. Cupid aware of any questions or concerns that you may have. Photos will be taken from 2.30 to 4 p.m. on both days. Interested in going to the National Museum of African American History and Culture in D.C.? To date, the museum has collected more than 36 artifacts and nearly 100,000 individuals have become members. The museum opened to the public on September 21st, 2016 as the 19th in the new museum of Smith Institution. Don't miss out. Money and permission slip are due by October 11th to Ms. Brown in room 117B. In celebration of National Hispanic Heritage Month, we will add a fact and a word of the day. For today, interesting fact. The next time you use a stapler, thank the Spanish. The first known stapler was made in the 18th century in the Basque country, and every single staple was engraved with the royal emblem. The phrase of the day is, Estar como una cabra, is a literal meaning mean to be like a goat. However, Spandard used this word to describe someone to be crazy. Juniors and seniors, please keep checking Naviance for Todd's representative, re representative visits. They are adding visits daily, so check often. It's a great opportunity to learn about colleges. Please see a counselor if you need help. The first SADD meeting of the year will be today, September 23rd, after school in room 134. Our first topic of discussion is vaping. Is it worth the cause? If you have any questions, see Ms. Sella. If you would like to be a homeroom representative this year, check your school email to fill out the form. We are looking for up to two reps per homeroom. Take advantage of this opportunity. The BSU and BSBP field trip to National Museum of African American history and culture in Washington, D.C. now include dinner at Golden Corral. The trip money and permission slip is due ASAP as spots are limited. Please pick up trip slip in 101 or 117 and return as soon as possible. Attention all CHS seniors, please check your Sean Ham's email account. You were sent the senior portrait schedule today. Please check the date and time for your portrait. Also, please remember to complete the Cap McGowan order form. All seniors must complete this form. Please contact Ms. Jordan and their principal's office if you have any questions. Social isolation is growing epidemics in the United States and within our school. It could be associated with violence and suicidal behavior. One study found that chronic loneliness increased the risk of early death by 14. Young people who are isolated can be become victim of book, bullying, violence, or depression. And as a result, may pull farther away from society, struggle with learning, social development, and or choose to hurt themselves or other. This week there is a national movement called Start With a Hello. We are asking all students to say hello to someone they don't know this week. If you see someone sitting alone in the cafeteria, please invite them to sit with you and show your shouting and pride. Today, Today is, is Monday, Monday, September 23rd, Blue Day, Day 1. one. And, and remember, remember, pride is showing him. him.